Hi, this is Allison Sheridan, and welcome to another weekly tip video. Recently, Richard Baker did a fabulous tutorial for the app Notability from Ginger Labs. They've added a couple of great new features that I'd like to tell you about right now. I'm going to start by using the pen tool, and let me just draw a scribbly line. That's a normal line in Notability. For a long time, we've had the ability to draw a straight line. And the way you do that is you draw a line, and I'll make it kind of curved, but then I'm going to stop and hold still, and you'll see it turned into a straight line. We now have the ability to draw shapes. So I can draw something that looks kind of like a rectangle. If I stop and hold and let go, I have a rectangle. I can grab these little anchors, and I can change the shape and size. We tap away from that. If I get close to drawing a square, it'll draw a square. So let me draw something that looks kind of like a square. And now it's turned it into a perfect square. When I grab the corners, it's going to keep that aspect ratio. Let me use two fingers to scroll up to get us a little room here. The same thing is true with ovals. And I can grab this little anchor here and change the shape in that direction and in this direction. And if I get close to drawing a circle, it should turn into a circle. Again, if I grab the anchors, that's going to stay a perfect circle. Let's use our scissors here to grab everything. And I'm going to tap and let's delete those so we have a clean slate. There's a few other shapes we can draw. We can try to draw a triangle. Let's see, I'll draw something like that. And if I grab that corner here, I can change the shape. And I don't think that it'll really do a true equilateral triangle. If I grab the corners, I can still change the shape, but I can get it pretty close by myself. If you're very talented, you might even be able to draw things like a hexagon. Let's see if I can pull this off. I'll draw it like this, and I'm very carefully going to stop. And I didn't get it that time. Let's try it again. There we go. You can see how sometimes if you aren't close enough, it says, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. But now I can grab those edges and I can make this any shape I want. Let's select all of these again with our scissors and we'll select all that. I'm going to tap with my finger and then I'll tap delete. Another big feature they've added is the ability to make curved lines. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple-related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new, up-to-date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS-related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone, and even your Apple TV using the members-only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencast Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, visit ScreencastsOnline.com today and become a Screencast Online member.